hi welcome back to rebecca's travels or if you're watching my lifestyle channel hi welcome back to rebecca's lifestyle hi um are you is everybody okay and um as well as possible um i hope you enjoyed um the videos uh, yesterday or um of a new gym in my town Colville and and um, again a furniture shop moving to another location and um, in the Beaver shopping centre in Colville um, and um, if you haven't subscribed to my channel please subscribe and a big thumbs up and thank you for doing so um, I really appreciate it and um, today I'm going to be doing a, a roundup video on Western Supermare so I'm going to jump right into it um, now Western Supermare um, in the winter time if i'd have went over the weekend then there would have been uh, some lights um but um i went monday to friday and um, in the end so unfortunately i did not get to see the lights um but that event uh, was um on at the weekend that weekend but um again um my hotel um, was quite well it was a long way about 30 minutes or so at walk depending how f at far she were at walk to the closest pub um, it might have been a bit shorter distance at f for that maybe in the summer um, if um, say another pub or two was open um but um before i i i had to walk about uh, 25 30 minutes uh, to get to the nearest pub um and um down the strip there was if you uh, walk um at 10 minutes or so uh, five or ten minutes after um there's the witherspoons pub and um, that um some people went to uh, while on holiday um again um it was it was actually a quiet area uh, where my hotel was uh, based um again on the seafront as well um and um yes in the daytime even at, though it was the winter time um we still had the indoor pier um that you had to pay just a pound to go on um and um the shopping center um there's a beautiful shopping centre with lo uh, lots of shops in Western Supermare, um, quite a few. Um, again, on the outskirts of the town, there's hospitals, schools, um, leisure centres, etc. Et on the outskirts, um, and also uh, lots of parks and gardens um, to look at and uh, visit. Um, there's also um a marine lake in uh, the summer um and i bet that would be absolutely beautiful in the summer and um there's a lifeguard um shop and um there's also a, a tropicana um which has an indoor ice rink and um like toilets and a cafe um and um there's also um 
um, a theatre there as as well um, and a, a cafe in one um, called um, the Winter Gardens um, and uh, yes it looks um, a lovely place to uh, go and visit um, again plenty of entertainment on the pier for um, people all ages um, like um, there's um, lots of uh, games and um, a casino there's also uh, outdoor walk and an indoor walk and um, again you can go fishing on the pier as well um, but um, it is and there's also uh, rides it's like an indoor theme park at the pier so I mean you just pay for what you use um, and uh, there's also um, a gift shop on the pier and um, a rest um, a restaurant a fish and chip shop and um, another um, eating place um, so um, again um, a wide variety of a wide range of entertainment in on the pier um, if it is wet um, and um, there's also slot machines as well um, as well as like um, computer games or just games in general to play as well as the rides um, and um, again um, from the outside the Club Tropicana indoor ice skating ring looks wonderful and the winter gardens are wonderful also um, outside the shopping center uh, you and it's all indoors the shopping center so if it's raining bad weather then um, again you uh, you um, are not going to get wet um, again as for eating places there's lots of cafes um, quite a few uh, bars um, and restaurants around um, do, uh, doing um, different types of uh, cuisine uh, to choose from um, there's um, I've taken the bear back at Pia um, which is not been open for years uh, but they're trying to get um, planning um, uh, to um, do something uh, with the bear back here get it um, like um, in a fixed state uh, to walk on um, just say um, a friends of the Birkbeck uh, Pier um, but um, there's also um, a cafe around there that I, w um, I went to and that's not far, uh, far from the hotel and um, I had a, a lovely um, drink of coffee there and I really enjoyed it I think it's called the Cove Cafe um, so uh, generally um, in the summer um, again um, you've got the beaches um, and again water sports as well um, and the marine lake and um, the, uh, the beaches um, and um, yes there's lots uh, again I found it clean lots of bins around and um, also life boat ring in case anybody gets in any trouble so uh, yes I have really enjoyed myself and I would love to go back um, in warmer weather um, there's also um, a museum um, 
that um, when I go back to Western Supermare, I would love to do the museum, um, which is uh, not that far from the shopping centre. The shopping centre, if you're driving, um, it, 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 you can go by a uh, car because there's um, a shopping centre car park, which is uh, really um, nice to see. Um, I didn't specifically uh, see a, a, a market or outdoor or indoor market, um, but um, there might be one over the weekend, um, say on a Saturday um, or Sunday, etc. Um, but um, I just I didn't see one. It doesn't mean to say that there's not one at Western Supermare because it could be um, held on Saturday or Sunday. So I would like to say um, thank you for watching and uh, bye for now. And I'll see you uh, for another roundup video on Bath, which is going to be tomorrow. So please keep watching and I'll see you tomorrow and bye for now. Thank you. Bye.